From News 19, I'm meteorologist Daniel Bonds. Pollen levels in this medium range and it's grasses now as we continue to transition through the month of May and certainly as we go into June, those grass pollen levels will increase. 97 degrees, the record high, record low is 42. Record rainfall is over three and a half inches. That was set back in 1901. Did manage to make it up to 83 degrees yesterday. Sunday, we only hit 72 with the clouds and rain in place. We did pick up six hundredths of an inch of rain on Sunday. We were dry obviously yesterday. We do expect dry conditions today as well as high pressure is going to be firmly in control of our weather. So we'll pick things up this afternoon. Good bit of sunshine could have a little bit of fog early Tuesday morning, but the pattern we're kind of in right now is not going to change until we get to about Friday. Then the moisture will start to increase just a touch. But Wednesday, good bit of sunshine, maybe just a passing cloud or two as we go into Wednesday night, early parts of Thursday, a little bit of fog possible in the southern and eastern half of the Midlands. And then once again, we do expect a good bit of sunshine, but the moisture will start to increase by Friday. Small chance for a pop up shower, thunderstorm, very isolated in nature. And then as we kind of look ahead towards the holiday weekend, can't rule out some showers and maybe a few thunderstorms in the afternoon and evening hours on Saturday, Sunday, and then even into Monday, which is your Memorial Day holiday. Can't rule out a little bit of rain. It's not going to rain all day, every day, but there will be at least opportunities for rain each day starting on Friday. As far as those rainfall totals are concerned, a quarter to a half an inch with some areas getting a little bit more really determining. It uh, really depends on, I should say, whether you get some of these showers or storms kind of hanging around your area over the weekend. High temperatures day in the mid 80s with a good bit of sunshine, a little bit of a breeze out of the east northeast and then lows tonight dropping down into the upper 50s to near 60 degrees. The heat index will be increasing as we go through the rest of the work week as well, especially as we get into Thursday. Notice those heat index values climbing possibly into the mid 90s. So the temperature will be climbing. Humidity levels will be climbing and so it's going to feel a little bit hotter than what these air temperatures are showing. So near 90 on Thursday, air temperature heat index values a little higher, upper 80s to near 90 on Friday, and that'll be kind of our high temperature trend over the weekend. Even as we go into Monday, the Memorial Day holiday, each day there will be at least that chance for some shower and thunderstorm activity. And Myrtle Beach, basically the same thing for the weekend forecast and more the same down in Charleston and you guessed it, more the same in Greenville as well with those opportunities for showers and thunderstorms over the holiday weekend. Looking ahead, 8 to 14 days out, warmer than normal conditions for at least parts of the Palmetto State, basically along and east of I-95. And we do expect at least a small chance for wetter than normal conditions for a large part of South Carolina as well.